Nine travesties that are delicacies. Rocky Mountain Oysters, also known as prairie oysters in Canada, is a dish made out of bull, pig, or sheep testicles. The organs are often deep fried after being peeled, coated in flour, seasoned, and sometimes pounded flat. This delicacy is most often served as an appetizer in Western Canada, where cattle ranching is prevalent and castration of young animals is common. They're really yanking the balls there. Yeah, yanking them off. Ouch. Jellied Moose Nose. This delicious afternoon snack is a pressed meat product made from boiled moose head and brain. After the head is boiled, it cools in a form with the gelatin from the boiling process. Although a Canadian delicacy, this process is used with various animals from cultures all around the world and is also known as head cheese. Ant eggs, also known as escamoles. They are harvested from the roots of plants in Mexico. They're most commonly consumed in Mexico City and surrounding areas. Escamoles have been consumed in Mexico since the age of the Aztecs. They're said to taste buttery and nutty and have the consistency of cottage cheese. They're typically eaten in a taco with guacamole and salsa. Casu Marzu, a procornio cheese and Sardinian specialty. This cheese takes the aging process a little too seriously. Casu Marzu, when translated, literally means rotten cheese. Italian procornio cheeses are purposely prepared to become the natural breeding grounds for nests of maggots. The process of producing Casu Marzu, aka maggot cheese, is considered a process of finely metered fermentation. To help those who choose not to help themselves, this rotten cheese is officially illegal. Baby Mice Wine. This drink, speculated to be of Chinese origin, can also be found in ancient Korea. The mice-infused wine is considered to be a health tonic, a cure-all to anything, from liver disease to asthma. The story goes that villagers who couldn't afford better medicine would drink it instead. Although there are no significant research proving its medical benefits, others still forward the claim that baby mice wine holds medicinal properties. So next time you see a mouse, instead of screaming, just think, that mouse could potentially have offspring that could heal me. Can chrysalis, also known as biondigi, is a snack food in Korean cuisine. Literally meaning chrysalis, biondigi are steamed or boiled silkworm pupae which are seasoned and eaten as a snack. Biondigi are often served by street vendors as well as restaurants and drinking establishments. They're sold in cans and grocery stores too, but they must be boiled in water before serving. What's next? Honey bumblebee pie? Soft boiled fetal duck, also known as ballot is a developing bird embryo that's been kept warm for around two weeks until the fetus is partially developed. Then it's boiled and eaten in the same way you would eat a normal chicken egg that's been boiled and eaten from the shell. It originates and is commonly sold as street food in the Philippines. They're also a common food in Southeast Asia. Eating ballad is controversial due to religious, animal welfare, and human health concerns. Oh yeah, and it looks really weird too. Tuna eyeballs. Tuna eyes could be found staring up at you at most Japanese stores for less than a US dollar. Apparently, it tastes a bit like squid and the eyeballs come surrounded by fish fat and severed muscles that are also meant to be quite tasty. To cook, you simply boil it, then season it to taste. Wonder if they give you better vision. Aping, also known as fried spider is a regional delicacy in Cambodia. The vending of fried spiders as a specialty snack is a popular attraction for tourists. The spiders are bred in holes and fried in oil. They're actually a species of tarantula called aping in Khmer and are about the size of a human palm. Taking a taste of one of these crunchy critters would definitely settle any fears anyone with arachnophobia may have. Hey, thanks again for watching guys. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button and leave a comment down below. See you next time, you'll want to know. This time could be enough.